Hey, if you guys want to see how I made this, just keep watching the video. So, all right, got our bleach in a spray bottle. I got three sweatshirts. Three. I got extra large. I got a purple one, a red one, and a black one. So we're gonna turn these into this. So, all right. Uh, I think I want to start off with. Let's start off with the black one first. So you see, I lay my, lay me some little paper down. You know, you know. Get your spray bottle, test it. Make sure it's spraying how I want it to. Come on now. I don't really like that spray. Okay, this is, I'm more like, more like a spray, spray. Not a shooting at your spray. Ready? Let us have fun. So just spray wherever. Try to get on your clothes. Make sure you got some raggedy clothes on or something. And then they'll start turning colors in a second. Uh, sleeve. Yeah, just give it a second. It's already starting to turn into a little bit. So yeah, we're gonna do the front first and then we'll do the back. What you think, guys? Definitely looks splatter, like blood. Still gotta do the back too, though. All right, so basically I make all my designs in either Illustrator or in Photoshop. And so I made this ahead of time, but I'm gonna show you um, what I'm making for the black crew neck. So I'm making this crew neck for my little cousin and she told me she wanted it to say princess material. So yeah. Um, found a font and then she wanted me to add a crown at the top so I did that and then I exported it as a PNG and I just uploaded it into the Cricut whatever it's called program and I'm gonna make it exactly nine inches wide so I'm gonna go to go and then it's gonna show me a little sample of what it looks like on my machine then I'm gonna do mirror image. It's very important because the way the vinyl is set up. Now I'm gonna press go. <laughs>
wanted to like be like a crop but I wanted to go across like like this like an arc if that makes sense 